Yeah. Uh, oh. Break dancing on stage. Mm -hmm. It's always great to see those throwback videos and yeah. see maybe family members and stuff. Really, I'm looking for my dad because he used to break dance. I think we should just bring it back. I think we should. You know? Can Katie? you break dance? No. Would you can lead us. No. I yeah, can, I, I think mean, I could. Kind of, I could, used to be able to do like the worm and that was about it, but oh. now I think I'd break a hip. That's pretty good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's what true. about you? Um, I know I couldn't. I, I guess I used to do some stuff like that. Now that I think about it, a long time you ago. Used to break yeah. dance? No, no, not exactly oh. break dance. But like Katie had some like just worm to stay. Like you know those little yeah. lasting break dance and moves. Sharice yeah. has plenty of those. She's just lying up here. I don't know. Well, yes. I don't know how to do any of that. I can maybe give you a good beanie weenie, and that's it. You did it I'll on take it. TV right. at, the, at that thing. Oh no, that <laughs> was second line. That? Oh, that, that was second, second line. line. <laughs> that was that was a break dance. <laughs> that's a little easier, I guess. Yeah, but heading into this weekend we do look pretty good especially tomorrow and Sunday it will be so pleasant and it's kind of strange because it is super pleasant right now even though we had rain this morning and we're actually expecting another little round of rain heading toward as I said about 10 or 11 p.m. We are expecting great weather tomorrow, Sunday, Monday, and then by the middle of next week, we will be warming up again with maybe some rain returning to the forecast then. Rain totals today, you can see up to about two uh, tenths of an inch of rain at some different locations, including downtown and Bell Chase. Other spots, not so much. Not a whole lot recorded at Bogalusa or at Slidell or Macomb or Gulfport even, but a little bit more over at Baton Rouge from that batch of rain that we had just sliding across the area. Mostly light to moderate rain earlier today. And now look, as Ricardo was saying, just completely blue, almost cloudless skies. But we have not seen our wind shift yet. South winds at about 11 miles per hour. Temperatures have made it up to near 80 and our temperatures will be going down this evening and then even more so tomorrow. Now these are our winds and you can see the arrows showing the wind direction here. We're still seeing south winds all the way toward Lafayette and almost Alexandria, but actually at Alexandria, we're now seeing northwest winds and same thing farther north in the state. So that's where the front is. We're waiting for it to move farther to the south and along the front. There is some rain, especially around Alexandria, right where the front's arriving now and especially north into other parts of Mississippi. We will see some of this skirt along some of our northern areas later this evening and into early tonight. Let me show you with our model here. 5 p.m. Fast forward to about 10. This is what I was talking about. A couple of showers or maybe an isolated storm rolling through, but it doesn't look like a whole lot at this point. As you can see, not everyone's getting the rain by then. 2 a.m. The front is continuing to pass to the east of us, and then this takes us to tomorrow morning. It should be a beautiful, very sunny sort of day with comfortable temperatures tomorrow and into Sunday as well. This evening looking pretty good. Temperatures just dropping through the 70s, getting into the upper 60s by roughly 10 or 11 p.m. I have about a 30% chance of rain to account for those showers and storms we might see in a few locations by about 10 or 11, but we will be drying out after that and clearing skies should be in the scene late after midnight and into early tomorrow morning. North shore lows, south shore lows, upper 50s and lower 60s. Then tomorrow for your Saturday, sunny, low humidity, dew point temperatures dropping into the 40s to 50s, north winds up to about 10 or 12 miles per hour, and highs around 77. Sounds pretty good to me, I hope you agree. And then Sunday we start again, somewhat coolish in the morning, 50s north of the lake, about 60 south, and high Sunday may only be in the middle 70s with maybe a few more clouds, but still overall a very pleasant day. Looking ahead to Monday, also looking good, maybe even temperatures dropping a degree or so. Tuesday, we warm way back up to near 80 and we'll have a chance for some scattered rain Tuesday, Wednesday, and maybe a few spotty showers Thursday as our next little low pressure system moves in and drags a cool front through at the end of next week.